Have you ever been overwhelmed when you had a lot to do, but then you take it step by step in increments and it gets easier and more achievable? Likewise, the idea of incremental care has grown in acceptance among healthcare professionals recently. It's basically periodically spaced healthcare or care provided in increments to help dental diseases get treated at the earliest with the proper diagnosis and operating efficiency. This also helps prevent the accumulation of dental needs beyond the minimum. In private practice, the periodic spacing for appointments is 6 months, while in public health programs, the duration is set to a year. Taking a patient-centered approach is extremely necessary for the successful implementation of incremental care. This requires the health professionals to take time and understand the patient's needs, concerns and goals and hence tailor the treatment plan accordingly. The dentists and dental staff need to explain the treatment plan clearly to the patient and highlight the benefits and risks of each step. Also, the patient should at all times have the basic opportunity to ask questions and provide feedback. The care provided should then be accurately documented in the patient's records, thus ensuring that each step of the plan is tracked and monitored. How has this approach been beneficial? Preventive measures like the use of topical fluorides and pit and fissure sealants are now maintained periodically. Even conditions like dental caries were diagnosed early and hence were treated way before pulpal involvement took place. Periodontal diseases too were treated at or near the beginning, thus preventing any serious complication in the near future. Apart from these, visiting the dentist periodically inoculates the habit of visiting the dentist regularly, thus avoiding the high expenditure of late dental care. However, this program too, like others, has its limitations. To begin with, visiting the dentist in stages, starting from childhood through old age, is extremely time-consuming. Here, since attention to dental care is provided from childhood, the care for primary molars begins when the permanent molars have just started calcification. Having spent enough on deciduous teeth financially, only for them to shed off in some time, parents don't feel the need to continue through the dental treatment after the permanent teeth have erupted. Also, in cases where the parents get relocated, there are increased chances of interruption in the child's dental health care program. In conclusion, incremental care is a patient-centered approach to dental treatment that can improve patient outcomes while minimizing the risk of harm. By breaking down treatment into smaller, more manageable steps, dentists can help patients achieve their oral health goals and improve access to care. For more such videos, download our app and watch videos seamlessly and learn through visually engaging mind maps. We hope we made public health dentistry slightly better for you. Please like, share and subscribe to our channel and see you guys in the next one.